Friends, we are gathered here in the sight of God to witness and bless the joining together of Sienna, Renee, Corey, and Casey Ray James in Christian marriage. Hold up, what is this feeling? I can't believe it's got me dreaming the colors in my mind. Come on, the clouds are rolling for us, blue skies unfolding. Let's see how many we can find. Well, last night, baby, that was nothing. Take my hand, I'll show you something. I can keep these feelings that I feel inside. I changed my mind. Oh, tonight, oh, tonight, I feel, I feel alive. If these dreams take us nowhere, then darling, that's all right. The covenant of marriage was established by God who created us male and female for each other. With his presence and power, Jesus graced a wedding at Cana of Galilee and in his sacrificial love gave us the example for the love of husband and wife. Sienna and Casey come to give themselves to one another in this holy covenant. Well, last night, baby, that was nothing. Take my hand, I'll show you something. I can't keep these feelings that I feel inside. I changed my mind. Oh, tonight, oh, tonight, I feel, I feel alive. If these dreams take us nowhere, then darling, that's all right. We can make a new start, cast aside these broken hearts. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> So love is an action of self-sacrifice. It is not based on feelings. You will need to remember that because even though your feelings of love for one another are incredibly strong and powerful, you will have those rare moments when you don't feel like loving the other person. And when those moments come, don't withhold acts of love while waiting for loving feelings to return. Love sacrificially in spite of your feelings. And you will discover the great secret that when you commit acts of love apart from your feelings, you will find that the feelings of love will be your reward. In the name of God. In the name of God. I, Casey, take you, Sienna. I, Casey, take you, Sienna. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For this day forward. For better, for worse. For better or for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. Sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Now, Sienna. In the name of God. In the name of God. I see and I take you, Casey. I see and I take you, Casey. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. The grace of the Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen. Casey, you may now kiss your bride. It is with a great deal of pleasure that I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Casey James.
all your family has become like my own family and I'm so thankful for that. I love you guys. And I know that there is a Nani and Papa grinning ear to ear right now and a Mr. Ronnie eating a lemon donut for you. I am so happy and proud for you and Casey today. You're the pepper to my salt and I wish you both the best. I love you Puffy and congratulations Mr. and Mrs. Casey James. <laughs> Me and him met in high school early on. Him and Chance and Jeremiah and everybody took me under their wing. At the time, I was in beta club on track to probably be a doctor until I got hooked up with all them. <laughs> now I sell propane if anybody's interested. <laughs> I love him like a brother. Uh, probably couldn't love him more if he was my brother. I'm so happy for them. Glad they found who they need to be with, and I wish them a lifetime of happiness. Cheers. And first, I would like to say you look like a fairy tale princess. Casey, you are a lucky guy. I am so proud of you, and I know that you guys are going to have a long and happy life, and I wish you both the best. So, cheers. cheers. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Love never ends. Watching two of my close friends get married is as good as it gets. I'm so glad that you both found each other, and I wish you both a lifetime of happiness. Cheers. Well, what can I say? Casey's a lucky man. He grew up near me. <laughs> I said, I wish you guys the best of luck and, and uh, just love you both and, and hope everything goes great for you. Being her big sister was such a blessing. She was the goofiest, funniest, <laughs> entertaining kid there ever has been put on this planet. Sherry and Sienna are very close. And um, when she knew that Sienna and Casey were a sure thing, she said, she's not mine anymore. She's Casey. You brought us so much joy to family and friends. Your soft heartedness and compassion, along with the desire to please those around you, have helped mold and shape you into the young lady that you are. And today is your special day. Today is meant to be a day like no other. That today, Dad's love gets the added benefit of including your wonderful husband. You know I'm loyal. This hand is loyal. It don't get no better than this. If you need to be free to believe it, I'm gonna be heady at it. For everything you want me to be, baby. You know I'm loyal. This hand is loyal. This time I would like to lift up a toast to Casey and Sienna James and wish them a long, beautiful, and prosperous life together. 